The neighborhood is quiet and calm to folks who live here. It is. It's a great neighborhood. I've lived here for a while now and I've, I've loved it. But after a teen was killed in a shootout with a former police officer, neighbors say they are concerned a common problem, speeding, could have triggered the confrontation. Yeah, it's a busy road. Ask anyone who lives here and they'll tell you their streets could be safer from fast drivers. Traffic does come through here pretty quick, oftentimes exceeding 50. Josh Hallman's home isn't far from where the shooting happened Wednesday night on South Addison Way near Gun Club Road and E-470 in Southeast Aurora. He says people do worry about how fast drivers speed through. I've seen plenty of kids roll through here going very, very quick. Aurora police say this shooting happened after an argument between the teenager and former police officer allegedly about careless driving. It escalated and police say both shot at each other. It was kind of a shock. But Holman says any interest he had in telling people to slow down is gone. I've wanted to talk to people that go flying through here, but now there's no way I would ever say anything to anyone after what's happened. His advice to neighbors after violence erupted in this neighborhood? Keep your doors locked, I guess. So is there a solution for people who live out here? Residents we talked to told us something as simple as speed bumps or speed tables on these streets might encourage drivers to take it a little slower out here. Reporting in Southeast Aurora, Rogelio Mates, Fox 31.